channel hope you all are well and I hope you all are staying safe today I'm going to be reviewing my pro breeze digital oil field radiator and this was a PR package from pro breeze so I'm going to unbox it and you know leave my review about it in this video um, if this is your first time of checking out my channel hello and welcome I'm a mom of two and I share videos centered around motherhood lifestyle reviews hauls and so much more and if that's the kind of content you love watching I hope you will stick around please do not forget to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel I post videos regularly and I would love to have you as part of my viewers so this is the packaging this is how it came um, but I'm going to read what is on here so it says it has four power settings it has an adjustable temperature control it has an advanced chimney construction 24 hour timer 10 oil filled fins overheat protection and a remote control so this is brilliant um, it has 2500 watts and um yeah that's pretty much everything so now on my review of this radiator so i've been using this radiator for about three days now and to be very fair it has been working very well like this is not a fan heater so of course with the fan heaters they take a lot of power or they take a lot of energy and um, you spend more money on electricity bills if you use a fan heater but with this one it's it's really cost effective compared to a fan heater um, so this one I really like it because it has this remote control for easy you know use I can stay anywhere in my living room and control it and I don't I do not have to go and push the buttons and start fiddling with the whole operating system of this radiator I can just do all of that with my remote I like the fact that the radiator is also very efficient and um, I really do not need to do much it just does the job for me um, and then there's another thing about this radiator that I really like you can set it on eco mode um, so this mode button right here I'm not sure if you can see the mode button but on the radiator it says mode on there if you press it once it will go to the medium setting I'm gonna press it once so it's it sets my radiator on the medium setting sometimes I like to leave it on the medium setting to heat up the room but on a very very cold day um, I set it on eco mode because the eco mode warms up the room faster eco mode allows you to set the room temperature I'm going to set it on eco mode now so I'm going to press it, the mode again the mode button again now this is the highest setting but when you press it one more time it goes to the eco mode and you'll see eco on here it says eco so now that it's on eco mode I can set you know the temperature and I can set the time so for instance if I want to um, set the time I'm going to press the time button and you can press this for one hour so for instance I'm going to set it for one hour so right now it's on 18 degrees Celsius and set for one hour so once the desired temperature is reached the power will reduce to save energy and um, the temperature will automatically go to 23 degrees Celsius so there's just one thing you need to note about setting your radiator on the highest power so the higher the power setting the faster it will get to the desired temperature that you want it to get to but the more power you will be consuming to to do that so it's best for you to set it you know on the lowest power setting or on the medium power setting just so that you do not consume you know so much energy but of course you know it's up to you to decide what you want to do depending on how the weather is and you know the situations or the conditions of your home but overall I'm really happy with this radiator it's been a lifesaver um, it's easy to move as you can see it's got tires so you can easily move it about the house okay 
you can easily move it about the house you can take it to any room of your choice it's not fixed like the normal radiators in in most homes um, so it's such a good one if, so if you're considering getting a radiator you can check out ProBreeze and see um, which one is best for you because they've got quite a few radiators um, I haven't tried the other ones this is the first one I'm, I'm ever going to try from their brand and so far so good it's been brilliant and I'm really happy with what I have so yeah that's it really for my review I hope you guys have enjoyed it I know it's been a bit of a quick one but um, yeah I just thought I should bring it on here in case anybody is looking for this ProBreeze um, heater and you know you want a review on it so this is my review it's such a good one it's cost effective um, it's efficient um, it warms up my room pretty quickly um, I like the design it really blends in with my living room and it's easy to move about or take it to any room of my choice um, and it's it's just brilliant I really like it so yeah thank you guys so much for watching my video I hope you guys have enjoyed this video please do not forget to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel i post videos regularly and i would love to have you join the family so i'll see you guys in the next one